Hi, this is Maths 3000. Today I'm going to show you how to work out the equation of a straight line uh, given, given two coordinate points uh, using the formula y equals mx plus c. So to do this then, first of all you will need to work out the gradient. And to work out the gradient you can use the formula y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. Uh, if you don't know how to do this already, make sure you watch my other video on this. And once you've calculated the gradient, you then can substitute this gradient into y equals mx plus c and want, choose one of your points and you should be able to figure out the intercepts from that. And then you have your equation of your straight line. So let's go straight into the example then. So I find the equation of a straight line passing through 3 minus 2 and minus 4, 12. So this is our first coordinate point x1 and y1. This is our second coordinate point x2, y2. So use the formula here then to figure out the gradient. So the gradient of this line will be y2 minus y1, so it would be 12 take away minus 2 over minus 4 take away 3. So 12 take away minus 2, well that would be 12 plus 2 which is 14. And on the bottom minus 4 take away 3 is minus 7. So 14 divided by minus 7 will give minus 2. So that is our gradient of our straight line. So we're going to use y equals mx plus c in this video to find the equation. So let's just copy this formula down. So we've just figured out that the gradient is minus 2, so we can substitute this into our equation. So all we need to find now is the intercept. So you can pick any one of these points to figure out the intercept. Both will give the same answer. Um, I'm going to go with the first one. So y is minus 2 and x is 3. So I've just substituted these points in for x and y. Make sure you get them the right way around. So minus 2 times 3 is minus 6 plus c. So I just need to solve this equation now to figure out c. So I get rid of the minus 6 by adding on 6 to both sides. So minus 2 add 6 is 4. So that will give us the intercept. So c is equal to 4. So therefore then, we've now got the gradient, we've now got the intercept. So if we copy the equation down again, so it would be y equals minus 2x plus 4. Um, if you liked it, this video, make sure you like it and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.